So yesterday Final Fantasy 13 2 came out in America, North America, but it's not out here until Friday. My copy arrived today, Wednesday, so I thought I'd do an unboxing. Uh, I haven't looked around because I don't really like unboxing videos, but I presume there's lots of unboxings on the internet, but this is different because this is European. It's the Final Fantasy 13 2 Limited Collector's Edition, the European version. Uh, this is signified by the uh, Peggy rating, which in this case uh, it's 16. Uh, the reasoning is that it contains violence, and there's a fist. I suppose you'll see a lot of fists in this game. This is the collector's edition, this is not the crystal edition, because I'm not an absolute mug, no really. It's uh, because the crystal edition, unlike other limited edition versions of games, actually did sell out quite a long while before so I'm sadly left I, with I d actually don't know what's in this I know there's a CD and probably some postcards or something so I'm gonna cut it try not to break this because you know it's limited edition it's clearly gonna be worth money in the future I can pass this down to the grandchildren off comes the cellophane and now it's open it's now uh, classed as not new this is a used copy of Final Fantasy XIII too. Let's open the box. Up, oh, it's some sort of 3D card. This is of uh, Lightning, who I hear isn't in the game all that much. And, I don't know. I don't know, you're supposed to wank off to that or something. I'll put that one aside for later. Next is, yep, this is what I thought, a CD. It's got, uh, sorry if I'm going this too quickly for you, it's five tracks there, it's composer's selected soundtrack, it's quite a crappy package in there, and there's the CD, again another nice picture of lightning, and here's a pack of cards, I guess I shouldn't open these, oh whoops. Right, so here's some characters on these things. There's a character. And there's there's another character. And there's another character. And there's Noel and Sarah and Snow. That's nice. And then there's a lovely book here, The Art Final Fantasy 13 2. Not sure if this contains spoilers. Some nice patterns. Uh, monsters. Bits and pieces. Character art again, just in case you didn't get enough of it. That's good. And lastly, the last thing in here is the game. The European version. This is from the big box, so it's not to be sold separately. So I won't go selling this on without the rest of it. And nicely, it just has the logo on the front, not a stupid picture of lightning or anything like that, which you may have in another country. And inside, we have the game disc on one Blu-ray. Yep, I own a PlayStation 3 and an Xbox, but I decided to buy it on the PlayStation 3 because there's no point compromising when you can get the best. And also, I don't have space for 100 discs. Here's one tidy Blu-ray. And if you look, it's shiny on the other side. And inside the box, there's an instruction booklet, once again with the logo. Does it have the character art in it? It has the character art in it again. So if you didn't see it the first two times, there it is again. I'm sure it'll be somewhere in the game as well. And uh, a code to register for something. And if you don't believe me, that's that box empty. And that box empty, so we have all of this stuff comes in the European limited collector's edition. I'm a collector, so this is being collected. Uh, and that's it, that's the unboxing. Uh, if you didn't like this video, feel free to comment and uh, make sure you mention that I'm British. Uh, happy Final Fantasy-ing.